9 Types of Ants and How to Get Rid of Them The pavement ant is one of the most common ants in the U.S. and is found in all 50 states. It has a brownish-black body and pale-colored legs and can be distinguished by the two spines at the end of its thorax between its body parts. To get rid of pavement ants. Carpenter ants nest in moist, decaying wood outdoors and in homes and buildings. If infestations grow, they may also expand into sound wood. These ants usually have more than one nesting site, including a parent and satellite colonies. To control carpenter ants. The odorous house ant will nest just about anywhere, under stones, logs, mulch, or debris, in the nests of birds or mammals, and inside homes, in walls, window frames, and insulation. To control odorous house ants. It is virtually impossible to entirely eliminate fire ants because of all the areas they infest. However, fire ants can, and should, be suppressed or reduced in areas in which they can cause harm or damage. When controlling fire ants. Thief ants, or grease ants, that are found to be nesting indoors are best eliminated through baiting. This can be as simple as placing a small amount of greasy bait near the areas in which the ants have been seen. When controlling grease ants. Pharaoh ant colonies can get extremely large include many nests. A single colony can have a single or multiple queens, with populations numbering in the several thousand. This ant expands its colony and creates new ones through budding, a queen and accompanying workers leave the current ant nest and walk to a new site to start a new colony. When controlling pharaoh ants. Ghost ant colonies have multiple queens and multiple nests and are very mobile. Control is difficult because of the many nests that often make up a colony. Therefore, even a direct nest spray treatment may not contact all members of all interrelated colonies. Like the pharaoh ant, ghost ants expand their colonies through budding. The same control techniques used for pharaoh ants are effective for ghost ants. Argentine ant colonies have many nets and many queens, numbering in the hundreds, with thousands of workers to tend them. Additionally, a colony that is eliminated within a structure will often soon be replaced by another colony. Therefore, it is critical that all Argentine ants in an area, both within and outside a building, be found and eliminated at once. Because Argentine ants expand through budding, control them using the same techniques used for controlling ghost ants or pharaoh ants. Field ants build mounds in lawns that can extend up to 4 feet in diameter and as high as 2 feet tall. They also nest in firewood and other such piles. To control field ants. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more interesting videos. And please hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm.